Hello everyone, welcome to Math is Fun. Our lesson for today is all about finding the area of composite figures formed by any two or more of the following. Triangle, square, rectangle, circle, and semicircle. What is an area? An area is the number of square units needed to cover the surface of a plane figure. What plane figure is this? Alright, this is a square. Suppose that one side of this square is 4 meters. Find the area of this square. Okay, what is a formula how to find the area of the square? Alright, the formula in finding the area of the square is side times side. So, our side here is 4 meters times 4 meters. 4 meters times 4 meters is equal to 16 meters squared. This is the area of this square. We can use also the other formula. Area is equal to side squared. So, our side is 4 meters. We are going to multiply it 2 times by itself. 4 times 4 is equal to 16 meters squared. So, these are the two formulas that we can use on how to find the area of a square. Do you know what plane figure is this? Fantastic! This is a rectangle. Do you know the two dimensions of a rectangle? Alright, the two dimensions of a rectangle are the length and the width. Suppose that the length of this rectangle is 7 meters and the width is 5 meters. Calculate the area of this rectangle. What is the formula how to find the area of a rectangle? Alright, the formula in finding the area of a rectangle is area is equal to length times width. So, the length of this rectangle is 7 meters and the width is 5 meters. Then, let's multiply. 7 meters times 5 meters is equal to 35 meters squared. So, this is the area of this rectangle. Do you know what plane figure is this? Yes, this is a triangle. Suppose that the base of this triangle is 6 centimeters and a height of 10 centimeters. Calculate the area of this triangle. Do you know the formula in finding the area of a triangle? Alright, the formula in finding the area of a triangle is area is equal to base times height divided by 2. So, our base here is 6 centimeters and the height is 10 centimeters. Then we're going to divide it by 2. Let's multiply. 6 centimeters times 10 centimeters is equal to 60 centimeters squared divided by 2, the area is equal to 30 centimeters squared. This is the area of this triangle. What plane figure is this? Alright, this is a circle. For example, the diameter of this circle is 10 centimeters. What is the area? To find the area, we're going to use this formula. Area is equal to pi times radius squared. So, what is the estimated value of pi? The estimated value of pi is 3.14. And what is our radius? Alright, our radius is 5 centimeters. Our given is diameter, then we're going to divide it by 2. Raised to the power of 2. Then, just bring down 3.14 times... 5 centimeters times 5 centimeters is equal to 25 centimeters squared. Then multiply 3.14 times 25 centimeters squared is equal to 
78.5 cm squared. This is the area of this circle. Since you know already the formulas how to find the area of some plane figures, now we can find the area of a composite figures. How to find the area of a composite figures? To find the area of a composite figures, you can separate it into figures with areas you know how to find. To understand fully how to find the area of a composite figure, let's study some examples. So we have here a square with a side of 10 meters and a triangle with a height of 9 meters. What is the area of the composite figure? To find the area of this composite figure, we're going to find the area of each shaded region. First is we're going to find the area of this triangle. So the formula in finding the area of a triangle is base times height divided by 2. The base of this triangle is 10 meters with a height of 9 meters divided by 2. Let's multiply. 10 meters times 9 meters is equal to 90 meters squared divided by 2 is equal to 45 meters squared. This is the area of this triangle. Next is we're going to find the area of a square. To find the area of a square, we're going to use this formula. Area is equal to side squared. The side of this square is 10 meters. So, raised to the power of 2, 10 meters times 10 meters is equal to 100 meters squared. This is the area of this square. The next step is we're going to add the area of a triangle, which is 45 meters squared, and the area of a square, which is 100 meters squared. Therefore, the area of the composite figure is 145 meters squared. Another example. Find the area of the shaded region. To find the area of the shaded region, first is we're going to find the area of the smaller rectangle. We're going to use this formula, length times width. The length of the smaller rectangle is 10 centimeters with a width of 4 centimeters. So let's multiply. 10 centimeters times 4 centimeters is equal to 40 centimeters squared. This is the area of a smaller rectangle. Next is we're going to find the area of the bigger rectangle. We're going to use this formula, length times width. The length of the bigger rectangle is 20 centimeters with a width of 8 centimeters. Let's multiply 20 centimeters times 8 centimeters. 20 times 8 is equal to 160 centimeters squared. This is the area of the bigger rectangle. To get the area of the shaded region, Subtract the area of the smaller rectangle from the larger rectangle. So, 160 centimeters squared minus 40 centimeters squared. The area of the shaded region is equal to 120 centimeters squared. Another example. Find the area of the shaded region. To find the area of the shaded region, first is we're going to find the area of a triangle. The formula in finding the area of a triangle is base times height divided by 2. The base of this triangle is 10 meters and the height is 12 meters divided by 2. Let's multiply. 
10 meters multiplied by 12 meters is equal to 120 meters squared divided by 2 is equal to 60 meters squared. This is the area of this triangle. Next is we're going to find the area of a circle. To find the area of a circle, we're going to use this formula. Area is equal to pi radius squared. The estimated value of pi is 3.14 and the radius is 3 meters raised to the power of 2. Then, let's solve the number inside the parentheses. 3.14 bring down times 3 meters times 3 meters is equal to 9 meters squared. 3.14 times 9 meters squared is equal to 28.26 meters squared. This is the area of this circle. To find the area of the shaded region, we're going to subtract the area of the triangle and the area of a circle. So the area of a triangle is 60 meters squared and the area of a circle is 28.26 meters squared. Let's subtract 60 meters squared minus 28.26 meters squared is equal to 31.74 meters squared. Therefore, the area of the shaded region is 31.74 meters squared. I hope that you understand our lesson for today and thank you for watching.